was growing the life of our firstborn child in my belly, we were watching my mother pass from cancer. Much like the symbol of the lotus flower, which rises from the muddy, murky waters into a beautiful, radiant flower, Bodhivita was born. During this time, John and I evolved to become much more compassionate people, and we were so inspired to impart what we had learned to others. We were inspired to educate people and empower people for future generations so that they have the power and they have the tools to live healthy, happy, fulfilling, radiant lives. Bodhivita is our invitation to you to join us on our journey. As holistic practitioners of uh, acupuncture and oriental medicine, we strongly believe that there is an internal external relationship with everything. We try to establish a positive self-loving and we also try to encourage this with our patients and friends and anybody we come into contact with. This is very important because the only way that we can hope to influence change is not adopt uh, systems that are quite, quite clearly not functioning. In this way, it's important to understand that self-love is not selfishness, and even if it is, it's not a bad thing. So we have to encourage a positive relationship with the people that we come into contact with, uh, with our food, with our environment, and with our family. So this is just one aspect of the system that we've uh, set forth. We are all so fortunate to live in an era where we have access is so much knowledge. We have a vast sea of information available to everybody via the internet. We have all these different healing modalities that people can, can use to get healthy and prevent disease. There's change agents that are being called into action. What an opportunity for us to step into our power. So we really hope that people who are interested in our products and in the services that we have to offer are inspired by what we can teach and what we can provide to be the face of change. The holistic health paradigm can be encapsulated by seven points, physical, occupational, social, emotional, environmental, intellectual, and spiritual. And we've used the emblems of the chakras on uh, our products in order to bring home the effectivity of the internal external relationship. And we've also included affirmations on each of the products, which we strongly encourage everybody to use. Uh, or speak aloud to themselves whenever using the product. And in order to be able to reach that point of transcendence, uh, it's important to deal with trauma. Uh, it's important to deal with uh, concentration, self-evolution, and uh, healing. So we've included some flower essences in our products that one, heal trauma, two, address healing at a higher level, uh, and three, allow the heart chakra to open so that we can experience life without fear, so we can experience life without judgment, so we can just go about our business without blame and simply be. We are committed to planting 10 trees for each product purchased. Our goal is by 2018, we want to have planted 350 million trees and we'll be planting them all over the world wherever they are most needed at the time. And as our company grows, our philanthropic efforts are also expanding. We have a lot of plans up our sleeves that we will divulge as our company has gotten bigger. Body Vida embraces the concept of living with and cooperating with nature. And uh, just as we were in the first part of uh, gestation with our first child, as Hilda's mother was passing, uh, Body Vida was born. And at this point, as Body Vida begins to grow, we're at uh, another stage in our family evolution. Lucky number two. <laughs> so it's a lot of motivation for us to maintain the momentum and just live as best as we can in harmony with nature and inspire as many people as possible. And a lot of good in the world. <laughs>